Good afternoon, YouTubers. This is Joseph Magi, author of Playing Card Divination and Fortune Telling, The Magi Method. You can find the book worldwide on Amazon and Kindle and paperback versions. You can find the full color card deck used here on Etsy slash Magi Method. You can join us on Facebook. Today we want to look at uh, the, the deaths. Uh, this man, Chris Watts, a Colorado man, has been charged with murder in the deaths of his wife, his pregnant wife. She was five weeks pregnant. This is Sh Shanann. And his two children. One is Bella, four. The other is Celeste, three. I'm not sure which is which. This looks like Celeste to me. So I want to explore this. Uh, also, there is the added wrinkle of, well, let's look at, let's do a relationship spread uh, for Shanann and, and Chris, and kind of see what was going on in their relationship, and then we'll explore some of the other issues. There's also an affair with a co-worker that was going on. So I'll put Shanann on the left here and Chris on the right. Let's kind of get a feel for what was going on in their relationships. In their relationship. That's Shanann, mother, man, marriage. Okay, you want it out. We see that we can see that pretty good okay so what is let's we'll start with the relationship okay so on her side uh, she's got the diamond ring that's committed to marriage she's got the man he's the center of her life she's a mother she's married to this man and this is her life Okay, there's nothing here on her side indicating that she wanted out. So, 13 and 12, 25, 27, seven clubs marriage. Seven, so, she is, she is all in. And he is the center of her world. Wow. Seems like a really good woman. A really uh, good situation for him. Uh, it would. I find that strange with her being so committed uh, to being a mother. I'm really kind of surprised. You know, so he's the center of her world. Shame on him. Okay, what's going on with him? Uh, there's only one heart here. Okay, well she has the heart. Okay, this this doesn't predominate with hearts. Her side doesn't predominate with hearts. It's about being a mother and committed to the marriage and him. Okay, so there's potential for some controlling behavior because it's not very loving. Okay, what's going on with him? He's got a heart. Okay, he loves his family, but this heart is very generalized. No full stop Jacob's Ladder, progress stopped. Jacob's Ladder goes all the way into heaven. Okay, progress in the relationship is, he just feels stuck uh, moving forward. He feels really stuck. He feels really stuck and trapped. Nine spades can be a trapped card. Okay. Well, that's, that's interesting. So, did he want out? Well, let's, let's look at this. Did, is this premeditated murder? Is this premeditated murder? Did Chris Watts, in a premeditated fashion, murder his wife, his pregnant wife, and two children? Is this premeditated murder? Let's put it over here on his side. Is this premeditated murder? All right, that's enough shuffling. 
premeditated murder. Incubus succubus, cornucopia, four clubs, roadblock. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, the adultery card shows up. Let's make sure I'm... Am I getting good focus here? I want to have good focus. Okay. Is this premeditated murder? Well, we got the adultery card, Incubus Succubus, and Roadblock, Cornucopia, Four-Leaf Clover. So these two are potentially sex cards. Uh, he's feeling very responsible with Cornucopia. Cornucopia is money and all material things. Um, let's add this up. 14, 18, five diamonds. Uh, he just felt, he feels trapped. He feels trapped and stuck. And he just feels very financially obligated. He just feels like, uh, he just feels very financially obligated. Okay, so premeditated murder. So interestingly, you know, the, the murder card doesn't show up here. He's just, he just feels that the relationship has soured and he feels trapped. And he's just, he's just very financially obligated, and he doesn't see any way out. He's going to be paying for these kids, uh, and therefore this woman, forever, uh, whether there's a good relationship or not. And that's how he's feeling. Okay, there's allegedly a... Okay, so, with regard to the premeditated murder, here's his story. He saw Bella sprawled on the, on the bed. Okay, Bella is his little daughter, the four-year-old daughter. He saw Bella sprawled on the bed and she was blue. And she saw Shanann, not Shannon, Shanann actively strangling Celeste. He flew into a rage and strangled Shanann to death. So he admits to, that's essentially uh, manslaughter. He admits to manslaughter there. He then loaded the bodies into his truck and hid them in, in an oil field where he had previously worked. So that's his story. Okay, that, the story that he admits to is not premeditated murder. Okay, and I asked if this was premeditated murder. This is not premeditated. This is a bad relationship and feeling trapped. Was, was, did he catch... Shanann, did Shanann strangle one of the kids? I mean, is there any truth to that? Because that seems like a pretty crazy story, but there's no witnesses. I mean, I wasn't there. Did he catch Shanann strangling the daughter, the four-year-old? As he said, finger of God, Mercury, straight razor, Ruler. Well, these are strange cards. I would expect to see a liar card. You know, if he's lying, I want to see lies. Okay, this adds 17, five hearts, fence sitter, finger of God, Mercury, straight razor, and ruler. Mercury can be a deceiver. Decision to deceive outside... Okay, so did he catch, did Shanann catch Shanann strangling the child? Okay, so uh, this is kind of a glib talker making it up. Finger of God, outside force. It's caused by an outside force and he's the father of the ruler, the father of the house. And he acted impulsively. Uh, that is kind of what this says. That is kind of what this says. I asked if he was a premeditated murderer. No, it just kind of happened. This just happened. Uh, and he's just, it's all very spur of the moment, just making it up.
He's just making it up. He's just making it all up as he goes along. Uh, this doesn't. This is not premeditated. He just. What a mess. What a mess. Um, okay, so there's another woman. It's apparently he was having a co uh, an affair with a coworker. Was she trying to get Chris to exit the marriage and run off with her? Okay, this other woman. What influence did this other woman have on this murder? Okay, so what influence did this other woman, let me write that down. Okay, so we got water into wine, strength and magi, and hand in hand. So hand in hand, he's several affairs. He's not showing as very adulterous, but hand in hand, many factors. There's no money here. 24 plus 8, 32. Mm. 32 is 8 spades, uh, scapegoat. So did she, was she trying to get him to leave the marriage? There's no leaving cards here. There's no leaving cards here. Did she manifest strength, many hands in the, the rooted situation? There's no female, there's no specifically female cards here. He's kind of just very casually adulterous. He's kind of very casually adulterous. Uh, and he's maybe... Uh, eight hearts can be a liar card. Maybe he's a, a, a pathological liar. Manifest. Yeah, exit. Trying to get him to manifest an exit. I don't see her being very responsible. I don't see her being very responsible, okay, or really trying to get him to get out of his marriage and go with her. I don't see that going on. Okay, so what happened? What's the relationship? Okay, she's a mother. He's the center between them. She, he's the center of her world, and this is, the, this is marriage, and it adds seven clubs. So she has seven clubs and two diamonds. The marriage, the marriage and the children, that's her whole life. She, that's her whole life. She's very committed to being a mother and being married to this man. He is the center of her life. Uh, but there's, it's lacking a lot of hearts. Okay, and she kind of idolizes him. King of Hearts is a good man. She's kind of, you know, holding him up on a pedestal. Okay, as, you know, the man of the house, the provider. That's nice, actually. Um, okay, because men will do that for women. She's doing that for him. Okay, she's just holding up this beautiful image of him uh, because she's relying on him and he's her husband, etc. She's very committed. No indication that she wants out. Okay, him, he's got the no card right in the center. Uh, he does love his family, but this is a very general love, and he just feels really stuck. From He's not able, he feels like, he just feels stuck and trapped, like he can't move forward in life. He loves his family, but he just feels stuck and trapped. Yeah. And there's not enough love over here to make it all worthwhile. Is it premeditated murder? Well, it's based on feeling stuck and a bad relationship, and he just, the obligations of having three children, he's got two and another one's coming and then he has to support the wife. He, he's got just too many financial burdens and the relationship is not wonderful. And it wasn't premeditated. It wasn't premeditated. Was it premeditated? No. It's just a bad relationship and it just happened. Uh, did he catch Shannon strangling 
one of the babies. Well, there's no woman card here. There's no babies here. There's just a deceiver, a glib deceiver, who just makes this up on the fly. And, you know, he's saying that it's because of her, of someone else interposing their will, the finger of God. Okay, that's 17, five hearts. He's just reacting. He's very unpremeditated. He's just, he just plays everything by ear. He just makes it up as he goes along, all of it. Okay, so he just, Mercury's a deceiver. He's just making it up as he goes along. Okay, th this affair that he's having at work, he's had many affairs. It's not just her. He's had many affairs, and this is so casual. This is just a good time. Water into wine is drinking. It's a good time. He can have a good time in his environment and with lots of people. He's not even committed to this woman. He doesn't care about her. She's not, like, very important to him. He's just, he's just living his life, man. And he just takes it as it comes. And, oh, my God, I have three children and this wife, and she's very committed. It's solid. I'm just going to do whatever the hell I want. And, oh, my gosh, it went bad, and I'm just going to strangle her now. So uh, it's not premeditated. He just, he's somebody who is very, he just takes life as it comes. Okay, he wants to enjoy life. He takes the joy of life. He just wants to take life as it comes and suddenly uh, just enjoying his life and having a, a wife and beautiful children and another one on the way, he just suddenly realized that all of his options are gone. His, the way forward, he's not free anymore. He's not free. He's really feeling trapped. Okay, and... That's just not a good feeling for him, and he, there's no premeditation in this man. It just happened, and he's just making up this story on the fly, and he doesn't even care about that other woman. That's what I see. Very sad. That's what I see. I'm Joseph Magi, author of Playing Card Divination and Fortune Telling, The Magi Method. Find the book uh, worldwide on Amazon and Kindle and paperback versions. Find the full color card deck used here on Etsy slash Magi Method.